me, Tosi, two of my favorite people. Um, what can I say about these two? They're absolutely amazing, wonderful, intelligent characters, and they completely complement each other. Um, I remember one time, I told a joke about what an argument between me and Tosi would be like. And I said they would just stare at each other in silence for about 30 seconds. They would know what each other were thinking, and then the argument would be resolved just like that. Because that's how they are. They're just very gentle, kind-hearted, simple people. However, after I told that joke, I observed something. I realized that they both had a bit more fire in them. When they would argue, now this is how I think it would go. I think Tosi would look at me and say, hmm. Ni would look at Tosi and say, this is rubbish. And that would be the end of the argument. Anybody who knows them would know. That's literally how they are. Hmm. And this is rubbish. Essentially, what I'm trying to say is, these two are so, so sweet. And they are a match made in heaven. Um, and I wish you guys all the best. I wish you a life full of prosperity, um, a life full of wealth, a life full of blessings upon blessings upon blessings. And I pray that you guys continue to grow in love. Um, and I pray that all your heart desires are granted. Um, I can, you can come and say a few things before we raise the glass. Good evening, everyone. Um, for those who don't know me, my name is I.K. Isekwe. I met me uh, in 1996 on the first day of school in King's College. He was my roommate in college in Baltimore. He's my neighbor as we speak. My son is named after him. I'm Igbo, by the way, but my son is on today. That's his middle name. That's how much I love him. Um, I don't want to cry because everybody sees me as a big boy, but I really do love him. I'm not going to lie. Um, he met Tosin about four, five years ago, and um, he introduced me to Tosin. I've never seen anybody so organized, upright, and um, focused. She went for her master's. And um, that's when I knew um, Ni was going to marry Tose. Because uh, no disrespect to Ijebu people, but uh, Ni is Ijebu and is in the financial sector. When Ni went, uh, when Tose went for her masters, two months went by. The next day, Ni came to me, I'm going to see Tose. And I said to him, is she around? He said, no. But she's in England, he's going. Uh, everyone here, Tosin, uh, Lee did not have savings for that whole year. He was in London at least every two months to see Tosin. At the time I started wondering, Tosin, 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 why? Now I'm fond of Tosin. I even got attacked by my wife recently. That who is marrying Tosin? Is it you or me? And I said, your Yoruba people say, my wife, Yahoo. So it's both of us that are married to sin. The same person that attacked me about to sin, if I check my wife's phone at any time for some reason, the next day she's chatting with to sin. Who are you talking to? To sin. To sin. To sin. I'm fond of to sin. After speaking to to sin for about three months, I knew it was like, um, me dated him for about two, three years and said I was going to marry her. I started talking to Tosin, we became close, and I came to my friend Nii and I said, Nii, this girl has scammed you. And his face changed. He said to me, what do you mean that uh, Tosin has scammed me? I said, how is this girl 25 and she's so mature, she's not on Snapchat, she's not on Instagram. Like, how is somebody so mature? She talks to me, by the way, um, I've been married for three years and I have two kids. I talk Hello. to her about marriage. I talk to her about at schools that my kids will go to. That's how mature she is. And her, and, and her eyes are just on the wall. 
I remember when we went for her introduction in um, Ilori. How is the bride texting everybody that your boss is ready to go? She's supposed to be enjoying herself. Just to round this off, I just want everybody to give a round of applause to both knee spirits and to see spirits. When in this kind of generation you bring up morally upright children like this, you, you, you just have to give them a round of applause. So a round of applause to our kids and your lawyers for bringing up children like this. Nigeria is going to be a better place once you have people like this that you have brought up. With that being said, I'm just going to pray for the couple and tell them um, I pray that God will be the third God in your marriage. I pray that God will guide and guard you in everything you do. And uh, I guess let me raise my glass now. Can everyone kindly stand while I just make this toast? Thank you. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Olukoya will sit. I mean, that sounds so sweet now. Mr. and Mrs. Olukoya, wow. You know? So I pray.